Another yellow vest demonstration outside City Hall, but this time they're met with supporters of the LGBTQ community. CHCH Evening News with Nicole Martin. Good evening, Nicole Martin's off today. I'm Phil Perkins. Thanks for joining us. Well, they say it's their way of opposing hate and intolerance in our city. Supporters of the Pride community stood outside City Hall today in hopes of drowning out the Yellow Vest protesters. Since the violent Pride event two weeks ago, many are taking a more active stance on the far-right protests, calling them unacceptable. Kelly Patello has a story. It was LGBTQ supporters against the yellow vests. Hamilton has no place for fascism and right wing people who are against immigrants, queer people, trans people. I'm a very fortunate person. I'm a person of privilege, white cisgender male. And I think it's incumbent on people like me in particular to stand up against this kind of thing. The yellow vests have been protesting at Hamilton City Hall every weekend for months. The far right movement that has spread across Canada is anti-Trudeau, anti-carbon tax and anti-immigration. The pride protesters say the yellow vests are also against Muslims and queer people. The city police have that mandate of recognizing what hate is um, and they're just not necessarily applying it the way they should be. Some yellow vests were seen protesting at the Hamilton Pride event two weeks ago when violence broke out. Both those who identify as LGBTQ and cisgender on this side of the barricade say enough is enough. Protesters who stand with the LGBTQ community say having the yellow vest protest here at City Hall week after week is fueling intolerance and hate in Hamilton. These groups have been showing up for, for months now, unfortunately, and after what happened at Pride, I think the community started to wake up for, to what they really stand for. Spouting hate about immigrants, about communities of color, um, about LGBTQ people, and it's time for the community to just say, tell them that they're not welcome. But the Yellow Vests say it's their right to protest in front of City Hall. We have the rights to assembly, we have the rights to uh, speak, free speech, we have the right to protest. Some of the Pride supporters wore masks. They say they cover their face because the Yellow Vests take photos of them and have followed them home. One Yellow Vest protester came face to face with the counter protesters. Nazi go home! Police removed the man and brought him back to his side. It's been two weeks of unrest following the violence at Pride. A protest at Gore Park last night slammed city council and police for not standing with the gay community. Well, it's unfortunate uh, that that's, that's uh, the statement right now. Uh, we're doing our best to, to look after everybody, all our citizens. Protesters marched down King Street in the middle of the road and eventually set off fireworks, blocking traffic last night. Hamilton police say they're still combing through the videos online of the violence at Pride and need victims to come forward. Phil. Thank you very much, Kelly.